Hi. Welcome to the stream. Today I'm gonna draw some stuff. Pretty excited about that. It's always had this little intro here where you pick up the sword. And I like the sword drawing, but I don't like the background. The background looks too... I don't know. I'm just gonna draw the background. See what happens today. It's gonna be kind of a short stream. The lady's making dinner. So, I'm gonna jump right into it. Uh, here's this. What? The, do I have a background here somewhere? I do. Okay, cool. This is the image I want. <laughs> nice. You like that? Oh. In honor of Bob. How you doing today, salad dogs? Well, today we're going to draw some happy trees. I gotta get better at my Bob Ross voice. That was really not that good. I'm doing good, man. I'm really excited that my state legalized marijuana. What's up, Pedro? What's up, Ogreshud? What are my thoughts on the new president? I mean, I don't really have many actual rational thoughts. They're more of just like kind of raw fear. My lady had some good advice. She's like, you should really just think about it uh, optimistically and just hope that we're wrong and like just maybe he'll prove us wrong but yeah i'm actually most excited i'm i think this is really cool that california um what else california massachusetts and nevada nevada all of those legalized marijuana decriminalized a freaking plant can you believe that finally which is really great because next time we go to when next time we go to burning man Weed, weed will be legal in California and Nevada, so bam, we can take weed to Burning Man. Yeah, right. At least give him a chance. Yeah, I'm pretty surprised. What's really funny though is that, um, you know, Hillary Clinton won the popular vote. Like, if if our votes actually all counted. In the, in the United States, or if it was a fair system, um, then we would have elected Hillary. But because we have this Requiem for the American Dream style electoral college, yes, Bernie Man has always been a toking man, but now it just will be freely toking man, which is going to change things a lot because there's a super vibe there. There always has been. Where you just got to keep things real hush hush. Got to get be like, oh my god, it's really there's like a real fear of law enforcement at Burning Man, and it's I think that fear is going to be a lot more relaxed next time. Thank the good Lord. Thank the good. Thank everybody. Oh my god, how you been, Pedro? What's what's new, man? So what am I going to do to make this look better? Let's see, this is okay. I just blurred this. Yeah, let's take this and just start making it look better. I'll um I'll hide the sword part. And just work straight on this background. So this is my goal today. It's probably gonna be a short stream, maybe like an hour because my lady's cooking dinner. So I'm just gonna draw this, make it look better. That's it.
Hey, what's up, Teague? How's it going, man? Dude. Yep. Well, not necessarily, Teak. Us Americans, we actually voted for Hillary. If you look at the majority vote of United States voters, we voted for Hillary. But it's we have this stupid ass electoral college system that it that got Trump elected. You guys don't always have to top off the British people. The Brexit was crazy enough. Oh, man, I bet you guys really thought the Brexit was really crazy from your perspective, huh? That's uh, That was a big thing. That was a really, really big thing. Yeah, that's like, so, the, you know what's so funny, too? As I saw this tweet from Trump um, from, like, four years ago where he said something like, the electoral college is just totally broken, and it need it's a bad system, and it, it's just, I bet he's not thinking that now. Yeah, let's see what he'll do. I mean, you know, there's there's no sense being fearful. I was fearful at first, but really, it's not. It's not going to help anything being fearful. You think it's a necessary compromise? A straight popular vote would guarantee that most populous areas of the nation would have a greater influence. Huh. <laughs> really? You also posted that? Ah. Uh, huh. There's got to be a better solution, though, you know? Like something that kind of like. prevents situations from happening. That are not desirable, you know? Yeah, I guess so, huh? Hmm. Huh. I, really, I didn't really think about it that way. It's, it's complicated, right? Wait, wait a minute. This is a rock. I'm drawing this rock like it was dirt. Oh, this is wrong. What am I working on today? I'm just working on drawing this little background here for the when you pick up the sword. What you doing today, T? What's new?
Yeah, the best thing people could do is vote, totally. You're breaking Overwatch? Nice. I think that I think our voting numbers were actually better. Better than that. Um there's a Wikipedia on it. Voting turnout. Yeah, voter turnout's up by four point seven percent. Wow, that's bigger than the last one. But it's a wiki here it is, Wikipedia article about it. What's up, Kobarney? Uh, oh, wait. Yeah, but 300, the 300 million people we have are not of all voting age, are not el not all eligible to vote. So if you look at our actual voter turnout, the, uh, the, num the percentage of people that could vote versus the, p the people that did, here it is. 2012, we had 59% um, or 55% of people voted that could. And in 2016, yeah, we have our current we have our current numbers here, 120,000. That's about right. But I guess they haven't filled in the number of uh, vo uh, eligible voters yet in 2016. Maybe don't hold them on a weekday. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Teak, we can um, we can vote by mail in the United States, so. And all that, so you can you can submit your vote by mail like the whole weekend before, like or some you you can you can mail it in. Yeah, you voted a month ago. Nice. It is kind of a funny point though. If if you had to vote in person on the day of, there definitely would be a. A lot less votes. Oh yeah, you have a zero chance. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, me too. Me too. Yeah. There's no point in expecting the worst. Yeah.
right? I mean, what what good is it going to do for us to expect the worst? We'll just worry, which will kill our opportunity to enjoy the current moment for what it is. <laughs> yeah, let's definitely hope about that. God. Thankfully, there's some people in our country that are already doing a lot of things about that, you know. Have you guys uh, have you guys seen that Elon Musk released um, these um, solar power solar powered um, roofing tiles? This is pretty neat. They look exactly like regular roofs. So you can get them in all these kind of different roofing tiles. And um, and they, they're actually solar. You get solar power. Here's like, here's one, here's another one, here's another one, here's another one. And they last longer than regular roofing tiles. Yeah, I mean, this is pretty neat, right? You can just make a regular roof, a roof that looks like it's super regular, but it powers your house? Uh, well, yeah, I guess I guess so. Yeah, pretty much new construction or if you're just going to re-roof. Yeah. It's not so Yeah, for people that are that are in the in the the moment where that is applicable to them. It's a pretty neat thing. Man, I don't know about this background yet. I'm not really feeling it yet. What does this need to look better? Oh no, your friend got arrested? Because he saved someone's picture? What? That's weird. Just because he'd saved somebody's picture? Like copyright infringement style save their picture or like stalker style save their picture. Volks for had some Oh man, kindling ethnic discord, but it's not true, huh? Okay, what's this going to look like eventually when I filter it? I 
guess that looks a little better. Okay. Huh. Huh. They have. Another thing too that's pretty interesting is that India and China are at the forefront of researching um, reactors that are based on thorium, which is, first of all, can't be weaponized, and second of all, is far more plentiful than plutonium. I think there's a lot to be said for these next generation reactors. They're safer, they don't have to um, be changed as much, they can run a lot longer, and they can even reuse the resources uh, like the used up plutonium from older reactors and stuff like that. Google's trolling you. Trolling you. I'm being trolled. Uh-huh. Oh. Oh, really?
Oh, yeah. It's pretty bad, some countries. Hmm. I guess maybe starting over would have been a better way to do this. Like starting with the actual, like this isn't really pixel art. I'm zoomed out so far, it's like not really pixel art anymore. But I'm still trying to draw it in a pixel art style. Man, they're really. Wow.
Did that start happening recently then? They sent somebody to prison for playing Pokemon in a church? That's crazy. When did it start being like that? Man. It's an insult to the religious feelings? Prison? Just go. Just prison. You're insulting the religion? Prison. Jeez, man. Yeah. It's kind of looking all patchworky, but once it's all blurred, it should should be a little better than the whole blocky. Patchworky, I think, is going to look a little better than blocky.
Okay. Hmm. See how that looks with this kind of blur. What do I call this background sword something? Scene zero? No. Scene sword. That's it. Scene sword BG. Okay, let's see what this looks like. Oh, what? It saved. It saved. Oh, it always saves. That's right. So take away the sword. Wow. That's repression. Look cleaner, I think. This little corner bit didn't look so good. Right? Everybody's happy when a girl kisses each other. Right? What's with that? That ain't fair.
You just finished renting a new video? Sweet, man. What for? Out for Elite Dangerous? Nice, man. You been enjoying that? Oh, crazy. Nice. Wow, that is. That is really gorgeous. Wow, what a cool game. Remember you talking about it earlier? What is that? Like a moon blowing up or something? An asteroid? What's up, Mummer? I think I can make a splurt, a, a splurt, a smart blur. How do I do a smart blur? Convert for smart filters. Okay. Oh, nice. There, we got a smart blur now. I can turn it off. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, man, I need to use that technique more often. Okay, let's see how this looks now. Oh, it's an asteroid belt. Sweet. Yeah, I would be. I would be. What's so what's so ironic about that is I'm not smoking weed right now because um, my lady and I are trying to trying to conceive. We're trying to have a baby, so I got I got to take a really healthy break from it. And what's even more ironic is like I ordered this vaporizer last November, 
and it's like this kick-ass vaporizer it came from a kickstarter and it took 11 months for it to arrive so right when i had to stop smoking weed i got this awesome vaporizer and it's legal in my state it's like how how much more ironic can it get but it's good it's good to take a break it's good to take a break it's good for my body Maybe a little less blur now that I'm looking at that in the game. Can you, how do you adjust it? Oh, here we go. This is cool. I've never used smart filters before. Maybe a little more than that. Six. Let's try six this time. Ba, 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 ba. What's up, Rocket Bunny? Oh, we saved again. Took away the sword. Yeah, it looks fine. I mean, it looks better than it did, that's for sure. Hell, let's figure let's prove it. I'm gonna prove it. Get check out the old scene sword. Wait, first let's copy that. Okay, so here's what it used to look like. Oh yeah, it's so choppy, so blocky, blurry, oh. Definitely, okay, so if I Scene is this? Oh, scene sword. Random question How often do you send out newsletters? Oh, very rarely. I had this one issue where um, uh, I sent out some newsletters. I was sending out newsletters when, right, right, right when I was doing the Kickstarter in 2015 for Song Ringer. And, um, I got a lot of people reporting me as spam, even though they had, just, I'm pretty sure they're the ones that signed up for my newsletter. So it caused me to get a lot of bounced emails and stuff like that. And uh, I had to deal with all these problems. I had to send in the letter to Microsoft Hotmail and be like, hey, I'm a real, I'm a real person. Can you take me off your blacklist or whatever? And, um, they were like, yeah, no problem. You were you were only sending out a thousand emails anyways, which is we shouldn't have even put you on our blacklist or something. I don't know. Anyways, I sent out newsletters and it just kind of backfired because I really need to be able to send regular emails to people. So I haven't sent newsletters since then. Yeah, children do require sacrifice, don't they? Uh, I think eventually it'll be worth it, though. We like... Glad I did that. Glad I took that break for a month or two, or three, or four. However much is needed. See, yeah, your, my, the confirmation email did end up in your junk mail folder, right? Why is, why is that? 
I probably should use like chip. What's it called? The monkey one. Okay, so here's the new one. Yeah, that's a lot better. It's just blurred anyways. Cool. Okay, that's better. That's all, that's all I wanted to do today. Anyways, Mailchimp, that's the one, yeah. All right, well, yeah, I, as I started the stream, I was saying, um, I was saying this is going to be a short stream. All I really wanted to do was work on that background art. My lady and I are having dinner now, so that's going to be it for today's stream. Um, but let me, oh, let me show you this. If you guys haven't seen this, this yet. This is what I worked on yesterday, this is pretty cool. Um, after this sword fight here with this guy, there's a little segue. This is pretty neat. So it introduces this guy. Yep, so I'll be back tomorrow. I'll be continue to work on this little scene here where you pick up the sword to make it more story-based. Um, I'm, I'm planning for tomorrow to have some little robots come down out of the ceiling and scan you and Jib and be like, bloop, 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 set off some alarms or something like that. So that's what I'll be working on tomorrow. So thanks a lot for watching, everybody. And uh, it was good chatting with you for a minute. And we'll see you later.